Throughout the rest of the week, we're going to see temperatures continuing to yo-yo. And currently, we have a very cold snap in northern Britain, resulting in scenes like this over northern Scotland for the rest of today, at least. Not surprisingly, with temperatures just a few degrees above freezing. And elsewhere, we're seeing temperatures much lower than they were yesterday, and it's feeling bitterly cold in those strong northwest winds. But we will see temperatures on the mild side for Thursday and Friday before we see the colder weather coming back for the weekend, particularly in the north, with temperatures temperatures by Sunday very similar to today. Now we're going to see those snow showers continuing in north and northwest Scotland, heavy and frequent, giving a significant snowfall over the high ground with drifting in those strong winds. Currently we've got snow depths of six centimetres in Aviemore and nine in Fair Isle, and we can see the crop of snow showers across many parts of northern Scotland. And those snow showers are accompanied by gusts up to 60 miles an hour, and even over northern Ireland and northern England we're seeing gusts of 50 miles an hour. We can see the tightly packed isobars responsible for those strong winds and also this little front which will run down the eastern side of the country during tonight and the little front here which is going to run down the southwestern side of the country tonight and again tomorrow. So for the rest of this afternoon it's a cold raw wintry look to the weather over Scotland, some wintry showers into Northern Ireland, Northern England and Northern Wales, bright though with a good deal of winter sunshine elsewhere in England and Wales, although temperatures around 7 or 8 but very raw in the north of Scotland, a high wind chill factor here down to minus 14 in those strong winds. Now tonight we'll still see further snow across northern Scotland, some snow running down the North Sea coast and out in the southwest we'll see some patchy rain sliding in from the northwest and we'll see a hard frost particularly in central and eastern areas. So tomorrow we'll see that patchy rain with a little bit of sleet over the high ground slipping away southeastwards. Some brighter weather though for more central areas later. Bye bye for now.